Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am really excited for today's video. I am gonna be showing you guys 10 different maternity outfit looks that are really easy. They go from super casual all the way up to really fancy so you can get dressed up for date night or your baby moon. So I have lots of really good stuff to share with you. A little bit of a backstory. This is my second pregnancy with baby girl number two. My first pregnancy, I really never felt super cute. So going into this pregnancy, I knew it was going to be something that I wanted to prioritize, making sure that I got the right pieces and I was feeling stylish and cute during my whole pregnancy and not frumpy and yucky. So that's what today is going to be all about. I'm excited to share these looks with you and hopefully this can inspire you and your wardrobe for your pregnancy. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay, so the very first outfit that I have to share with you is actually the outfit that I'm wearing. So I'm gonna go through a little bit about the pieces and then as I'm talking through that, I'll show you some cutaways of how I style them so you can see what they look like on as well. So the first uh, piece that I wanna share with you is these maternity leggings from the company called Blanky. It's B-L-A-N-Q-I. I am really, really picky when it comes to leggings. I'm picky when I'm not pregnant and I'm even more picky when I am pregnant. I'm the type of person who wants something that is gonna suck me in. But when you're pregnant, you can't really suck in your stomach, so I want something that's gonna suck in my legs. We all know when you're pregnant, your hips get bigger, your thighs get bigger, and I just want something that's gonna suck that in as much as possible. And I've really found that in these leggings, and this is really the only maternity legging that I've found that really does that like good suction and just feels really good on. They're super comfortable. So I'll show you in the cutaway, but they're really super high-waisted. So the uh, belly part goes actually all the way up to right underneath your bust. And this piece for your belly is kind of like a, it's like a stretchier part of the fabric and it's just basically like a pouch for your belly. So your belly sits right in there. That means that they can grow with you as your belly gets bigger through pregnancy. And they're just really, really comfortable. Um, I feel like I can wear these all day long. I can dress them up. I can dress them down really easily. So absolutely love these leggings. And then the other piece, is this plain white t-shirt so this is a t-shirt from target it was i think like 10 or 12 dollars the brand is isabel maternity every one of these like maternity clothing hauls that i see talks about this t-shirt and there's a reason for it it should just be a staple i'm wearing one right now i have another white one i have um, two black ones a couple of tank tops as well and they're just really easy to pair with a lot of different things you'll see in this try on i'm gonna pair them with like four or five different outfits and it's just super easy as a staple a basic I like to wear this with those leggings and put on an easy, simple cardigan right over it. And you look put together, but you're still really comfortable for the day. So it's a great outfit for running errands. You can slip on some um, you know, sneakers with it. You look put together, you look super cute, and it's really easy for you to throw all of that together. Like I said, the t-shirt is about 10 or $12 from Target. Everything is gonna be linked below. The blanky leggings are a little bit more on the expensive side, but they always have deals running. So I got two pair actually. Um, I have a small and a medium just in case I need to size up at some point. And um, I think I got them both for 50% off their, their original price. So you can definitely find deals, but even if they're not on sale at the moment, I honestly, leggings are a must have when you're pregnant. So I highly, highly encourage you guys to get some if you're looking for a really good pair of maternity leggings. Okay, so on to the second kind of outfit or look. Uh, you're gonna notice that I like one pieces a lot because they're just super easy to throw on. I am all about making sure that I can get out the door as quickly as possible. I have a toddler running around, so everything I wear needs to be super easy and look good in a matter of seconds. So I love one pieces and this is no exception. So this is like a um, jumper, like cottony material. Um, and it goes all the way down. So this is from, I believe, Pink Blush. 
yeah so this is from pink blush maternity this is a maternity uh jumper as well and seriously it feels like you're wearing pajamas but it's super cute every time i wear this out i get tons and tons of compliments on it it is super casual but it looks really good if you pair it with a jacket some slip-on uh sandals or something like that and you can just run out the door i absolutely love this piece so i wear this all the time and i'm probably gonna wear it post pregnancy as well because it's just so simple and so comfortable like you literally can't go wrong feeling like you're wearing pajamas all day i love it okay so another one piece another jumper jumpsuit this one is also from pink blush maternity this one's a little bit less casual than the last one but still pretty casual for you to wear it basically looks like you're wearing overalls um, but I love these. I actually wore these when I was in my first trimester before I really had a bump. And it was great because I still looked super cute and put together, but I, again, I was really comfortable. So um, you'll see in the cutaway, these don't go all the way down to the floor. They're kind of like at around mid calf length. Um, but super cute again. I typically pair this with the same white t-shirt from Target uh, Or a long sleeve anything really will work, but I love this This is easy to again run errands on the weekends go to brunch with your family Whatever the case may be and it's super easy to pair lots of stuff with so love this jumpsuit I think I have a few other one pieces as well. So You know that I love them for sure so next up is an actual like outfit it is two pieces so i don't have another one piece for you but there are more coming so stay tuned um, but this is again a super easy thing to put together uh, this flowy top it's just a plain white tank top i got this from asos this is a maternity shirt as well so I think pretty much everything I've shown you so far is maternity. I do have quite a few things that are not maternity as well, so I'll make sure to uh, mention those as we're going. But I love this. This is a really easy cami to pair with a leather jacket, a denim jacket, some jeans, some shorts. You can tuck it in, you can leave it untucked. It's just really um, comfy and very flattering on like any figure. So I got this, I believe, in a size... I got this in a US size six. I probably could have sized down. So I would suggest if you are like, you don't know what size you're gonna be, size down. I normally do wear like a small medium size shirt. So I probably should have gone with a US size four, but still looks really cute. I like slouchy looks, so I love this shirt. And then I pair that with this really awesome pair of maternity denim. So I also got these jeans from ASOS. A lot of people talk about how like, oh, I splurged and spent, you know, $200 on a pair of maternity jeans because they're so great. I really, I have a hard time spending that much money on jeans normally. I don't really wear jeans that much and I definitely have a hard time with it um, for maternity when I'm only going to wear them for a couple of months. So you can get really cute, really stylish jeans from lots of places for maternity. I highly recommend ASOS for sure. And again, that's where these are from. But these are just a boyfriend cut jean. The um, belly part goes up pretty high, so it's um, like over your, your belly button, over your belly. I have a belt on here. You can belt it, unbelt it. And again, it's just kind of that like boyfriend fit. I roll up the bottoms a little bit. They're just a tiny bit um, like frayed and distressed. And these look really cute with a lot of different things, with a t-shirt, with a cami like that one. And these are super easy and handy to have around, especially if you are already a mom of a toddler or more than one toddler, jeans are gonna be your best friend. So definitely a really good piece. Okay, so we're back to the one pieces, but this time we're not doing pants. These are both short or like romper options. So I'm a huge fan of rompers when I'm not pregnant. I could wear a romper for every outfit every day of my entire life because it's just the easiest thing to throw on and you always look really cute. So when I saw these, I immediately knew that I needed to get them because they, well, one of them is maternity, one of them's not. Um, but the first one I'm gonna show you is maternity. I saw it, it was on sale and I knew I had to have it. 
So this cute little romper is from Lego Heritage. I think that's how you say the brand. They're an Australian uh, maternity brand. And you guys, their clothes are beautiful, but they're also pretty expensive. So I have never bought anything else from there before, but I saw an Instagram ad, of course, as we all do. Um, and I saw that they were having a big sale on some of their summer uh, items. So I went on and I found this and just absolutely fell in love with it. It was over half off, so I think it was like 60% off or something like that. I think I paid about 40 bucks for it, um, and it is just the cutest thing. I actually have it in two other colors as well because I got this one and I loved it so much. I knew I was gonna live in these rompers when it gets hot here. I live in Arizona, so we're about to see like 90 degrees probably in the next two months, and I'm due in July, so by then it's gonna be like 120 degrees outside. So I knew I wanted to be living in shorts. I absolutely loved the way that these rompers looked. So I got this one in pink, I got a black and white striped one, and then I got just a plain cotton gray version as well. So again, you can pair this with the regular t-shirts, you can pair it with even a, um, like cropped cami underneath, you can pair it with a tank top, you can put it over your swimsuit if you're gonna go out to the pool or something on your baby moon. There are just so many ways to style this and I just think it's such an easy thing. And again, every time I wear this out, I get a ton of compliments from people. So this one to me is an absolute must have. Like I said, I, I got this on sale from Lego Heritage, so I don't know if they still have this in stock. If they do, I'll link it below. If they have other versions, I'll link those as well um, with, with their sale stuff. So I'll make sure to link at least something that looks comparable to this from Lego. Hopefully I can find this exact one for you but I love this. This is probably my favorite piece of like all of my maternity pieces I've ever owned. I'm obsessed. Okay, so next up, this is another romper, and this one's actually not maternity. It's gonna be kind of hard to see like how it's cut, but I'll show you in the cutaway. This is from ASOS. Again, this is not their maternity line, but I had a feeling that this is gonna work for maternity because of how the seam is. So it's a really um, like, loose fitting romper, very flowy in the short section. And then on the top, I don't know if you guys can see, but the seam goes kind of like up in the middle and then back down on the sides. And it's like right at the perfect height for your belly to be right below that seam, which is always really flattering. If you're ever gonna do um, non-maternity clothes and you want something that's still flowy, you really wanna look for something that has that seam right above where your belly is gonna start because that's gonna be the most flattering for you. So I, um, I actually got this before I was pregnant and then once I got pregnant, I was like, oh, hey, this is gonna work, this is awesome. So I love this one. Again, this is a really easy thing to throw on for us here in Arizona when I'm like out and about with my daughter Charlotte and we're running errands and it's really hot outside, this is gonna be something that I probably go for a lot. Even though it has long sleeves, it's pretty thin material. So um, it's not see-through, which is really important, but it is really thin, so it'll keep you nice and cool and you'll feel really comfortable in it. So love this piece. Okay, so the next dress that I have to show you guys is one that you hear about all the time, all over YouTube, Instagram, blogs. It's like the number one non-maternity maternity dress that you can buy. It's just like really fantastic. And it's the Leith um, like sheath dress. So it's got ruching on the side here. And again, this is not maternity. So this is also really flattering, even if you're not pregnant, because it kind of hides all of those lumps and bumps with the ruching. But it has a seam that comes up on the bottom. So again, it's really, really flattering on your legs and on your hips. And this is one that you can dress up or down. So I've worn this for date nights and put some heels on with it. I've also worn this during the day when we're just like 
putzing around and um, paired it with some slides. So it really depends on what you're wanting to wear it for, but it's super easy to dress this up or down. This is the long sleeve version. They also have, um, I believe they have a short sleeve version and I know they have a tank top version as well. I haven't gotten my hands on the tank top version yet, but I have been eyeing it. I got this one from Nordstrom. It retails for I think $50, $49, but they're having a sale right now on their tank top ones. So I will try to link those below. I got this in a size, this is actually a size medium. I'm almost grown out of it now because my belly is so big, so I'm probably gonna go back and get the tank top version in a size large. So I would just recommend size up one size if you can, and this is gonna last you probably for your entire um, second trimester, at least for most of it. So this is a really, really good staple item to have, and you can wear it post-pregnancy as well, which is always a plus. So this is another non-maternity item, um, and I think, again, this is a really great staple to have in your wardrobe, in your maternity wardrobe specifically, because it's super easy to wear this in a couple of different ways. So I'm gonna show you this one piece, but then I'm gonna show you two different ways of how I wear it. So two different outfits that look completely different from one another. So this is just one of those really tight, um, like midi-length skirts. I got this one from Forever 21. I think this was like $10. Like you can get them for really, really cheap. And they just look super cute when you hike them up over your bump. Um, it shows off your belly in the best way, but you can still look really cute, really put together. This one's just a plain gray one. Um, I know that they have some that have slits on the side, which are also really cute. They have a ton of different colors. I liked going for gray because I feel like I can pair it with a lot of different things for the top. Um, and so I've got two different tops that I'm gonna show you guys. The first way that I love wearing a skirt like this is just by pairing it with a super simple oversized t-shirt. And then I wrap that t-shirt up and I tie it right above my belly. And again, it's a really cute way to stay super fashionable, really trendy, but also you can wear it casually and you can, you know, wear heels with it if you want, or you can wear flats with it, sneakers, whatever the case may be. You're gonna look really cute with that, um, paired with that t-shirt. So that's a really, really easy way to wear this skirt. And another really cool way is by pairing it with a crop top. So I got this crop top also from Forever 21. It ties around um, your like, upper waist area here. This one has some like poofy sleeves, super cute. And you can pair this with your skirt as well. And you know, I feel like one of the like secrets to looking cute during pregnancy is crop tops. And we're lucky because crop tops are really in right now, but crop tops look super cute on pregnant bellies. I, I don't know if I'd wanna like actually show my belly, but they look really cute when you pair them with high-waisted skirts or when you put them over a dress or something like that. They look really, really cute and put together. So I think this would be a really great look for work. You could also wear this out for a date. Um, there's lots of different places that you could wear this to, but finding a really cute staple crop top or a few of them from somewhere like Forever 21 where you're not gonna have to spend a ton of money is a really great way to make just kind of a different um, wardrobe out of the staples that you already have. So I love this and I love both of those looks paired with this skirt. My next look, this is another dress. This is one that's gonna be really easy to wear, again, on date night, or um, if you have like an event to go to or something like that, this is really easy. This is also a non-maternity dress, and I found this at Forever 21. If I can't find the exact dress, I'll try to link one similar, but I just think this is super cute because um, it's really tight fitting. I love wearing things during pregnancy that are really fitted because I wanna show off the bump, I wanna show off my new curves for as long as I can. Typically when I'm not pregnant, I don't like to wear really tight stuff. So I like doing that when I'm pregnant, and this one is midi length, so it goes all the way down it's got buttons all the way down the middle here you can wear this by itself and it's really cute you can also pair this with a really nice cardigan and again you're just gonna look put together and it's a really easy thing 
you also don't have to worry about bending over and helping another kid and like showing anybody your goods. Uh, so this is a really good staple to have. And I think just any dresses like this, that midi length, tight figure flattering dress is gonna be a really good staple for your wardrobe. And then on to number 10. So I got this dress with our baby moon in mind. We're gonna be going on our baby moon in about a month. And I wanted to find items that I could dress down during the day and dress up at night if we're gonna go out to dinner or something like that. And we're also gonna be on the beach. So I found this super cute dress on sale from Express. It still has the tags on it. I thought that this was adorable and I had a feeling it was gonna look pretty good on the bump because I don't know if you can notice, but all of the material is that like stretchy, super like fitted kind of ruched material. So that's what the entire thing is made out of. And then the bottom kind of frills out a little bit and it looks so, cute and so flattering. I love the ties on the top. I love the print. I already paired this with a pair of slip-on sneakers and I thought it was absolutely adorable to wear during the day. And then you can also pair this with some heels. You can dress it up for nighttime as well. But I figured it's just a really good look. Again, super easy. I can pair a jacket with it if I get a little bit cold um, and I can wear it by itself if I'm out in the sun and it's just a really easy thing to um, to add to my wardrobe this was $20 so I'm gonna try to find this on their website and link it if I can but again it was on sale so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find the exact one but if you're looking for something that's similar to this look for this like super stretchy material because that is always going to be really flattering over the bump. The stretchier and the tighter that it is, I think the more flattering it is on your pregnant belly. Okay, so that's it. Those are my 10 maternity looks to help you feel cute and stylish during your pregnancy. I hope these gave you some inspiration for some outfits that you can put together and maybe even some things that you can start incorporating from your closet that you already have. So if you liked this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Make sure your bell notifications are turned on so you are aware every time I post a video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Sun is coming up, are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow. Your will is my law, I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'll go where you go.